Welcome back to Chasing Selexia. This is level two. As you can see, there are some clear differences between the original game and the remake, like these poles that you can grab onto, climb, and jump from. I was a little confused by this room, as I was expecting more than I think is actually there. It's just a basic tutorial, but I thought there had to be more to it, so I wasted a bit of time looking. I also fell from a sufficient height to lose a bunch of health. I considered restarting from the checkpoint, but decided to just roll with it. I actually ended up playing pretty badly in this level and using up a lot of healing items. Oh well, I'm sure that won't come back to bite me. Sometimes the AI's pathfinding sucks, and I'm not too proud to take advantage of that. I did much better the first time I fought that bear, but then I drowned. I'll come back for it. There's a couple of things from the original game sort of mixed together here. The switch I'm looking for is essentially the same switch Selixia is looking for, but she doesn't have to swim to reach hers. There's a bit later on though where I don't have to swim and she does. I actually think they made a mistake in the remake in moving the mandatory swimming section. Originally you got a no stakes swimming section in the middle of the level before the dangerous timed section later. Here you're thrown right in at the deep end so to speak. Here we see how much nicer box moving is in the remake. So smooth, so fluid, so much freedom of movement. I can drag it any distance, in any direction. Selexia and I tackled these two sections in the opposite order to each other, but they're essentially the same. There's this bit where the key is, and the ledge you can climb up onto from the box that was previously blocking the exit.
There's an extra key in the original game that didn't make it to this version and doesn't really seem to serve any purpose. I guess it would be a nuisance if you missed it. Just gonna reiterate how essential that health pack is going to be for me. Same key, same lock. For all intents and purposes. Painful even to watch myself playing that badly. And here we see one area in two styles. The only major difference, aside from the aesthetic, is that the two doors are open in the remake, but only one is in the original. There doesn't seem to be any reason for the change, aside, I guess, from giving the player the illusion of choice, because you need to go into both anyway. And the rooms within are essentially the same, both the same as each other, and the same in both games. Climb one side, get to the switch, then go climb the other side, get to the other switch. This, by the way, is the safe practice swimming area in the original game, before the dangerous one. In the remake, it's just a soft landing if you fall. The switch, in the original, is just a switch. In the remake, it's this rotating log thing. And now we go over the other side to do the same thing a second time. It's not always clear to me what's a ledge and what's just a decorative bit of wall. It 
It's not as bad as the original game, obviously, but Lara's movement is still a bit jerky. Doors open, and this is where we break away from the original game. As I mentioned before, there was a swimming section, equivalent to the bit I did earlier, while in the remake, I stayed dry for the rest of the level. A tutorial for a skill I've already used earlier in the game to get a secret. And yes, I see that glowing object down there, but I'm not stopping for it. It's probably a trap. This is another room that confused me, and still does. There's a ledge you can jump and grab onto from the entrance, but I don't know why. It doesn't seem to lead anywhere. I had initially assumed it was so you could avoid the floor, but there doesn't seem to be a trap of any kind down there, and I don't think you actually can avoid the floor anyway. I foolishly got hit by that spear trap trying to climb up onto that bridge, but you don't need to go up there, and I'm not sure there's even anything up there if you do go up. Anyway, that's the level. <laughs> 